Well, boys. How are you keeping, Hector? How's it going, lads? Not too bad. Not too bad. How are you keeping? things? Not too bad. What's the name? James. James, how are you getting on? I just got back from Mongolia. That's right. I've seen you on the Late Late Show, yeah? What was that like out there? Unbelievable. Was it? I'm telling you, minus 35. I've never felt cold like it in all your life. It's like putting your hand into the ice box. Jesus. You took off your gloves, like putting it in and getting an ice pop. It's that cold. Right, listen to this. There's three million people in Mongolia. It's five times the size of France. And there's four million horses. Oh my God. Huh? Jesus Christ. And people live in tents. Nomadic lifestyle. Yeah, yeah. Just like going back in the day. Back, back, to, the day, I mean? back to the older days. Back to Willie's time there. <laughs> <laughs> what age is that young lad with the horse? They're after cutting a gallop five miles into the snow, straight. And they're just getting them ready now. These are after run. Look at the size of this lad. Look. Six or seven. Look. James, we'll have to get you out of June, James. You can spend good money on these. Yeah, they, they, they wouldn't be that expensive though. They're only for jogging, as I said. They're yeah, heavy enough to get them fit. For, for training, for trotting. And this one here the is for when you go racing. That's the I for Williams of. That's it, that's Ivor <laughs> Williams. This is the Gold Mahar box, and that's Ivor Williams one there. <laughs> what? Go on. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Sure, but they have a different, totally different type of horse in Mongolia. Yeah. Stocky, stamina, and any time the horse wins, they put the ponytail on the mane. And the beautiful thing is this, listen to this. The stallions, the best horses who are stallions, yes. there's no covering. All free. The covering happens free. Every summer, the best horses in Mongolia yes. are allowed to go out to the, the plains, to the fields, yes. to the mountains, and they roam wild. Well, hopefully the boys in Ireland start doing that. <laughs> <laughs> could you imagine Galileo? Yeah, could you imagine? <laughs> We'd be all lined up with horse boxes on the way there. <laughs> Can you imagine if the best stallions in this country were allowed to go out and roam free and Mother oh, Nature takes its course? I'd get one of them find my iPhones on them. <laughs> See what field he was in. <laughs> Classic.